Okay. My name is Natalie. That's the tits. Um, I have a daughter who is 15 years old. She has uh, intellectual disability. And I've been basically traveling or out of Australia for the last bit over a year. Um, trying to find or trying to come up with a concept or a vision, um, an idea for, you know, how do I want our lives to look in the future? Where do I want to live with her? Like, at the moment, I, I mean, I realised the other day that, you know, if she had been a normal child, like, I probably would have stayed living in Karanda, which is near Nancy up. And, you know, she would have gone to the Steiner School. Uh, you know, we would have had a, you know, community or a group of friends around her, around us. The way it's turned out with her having special needs is that I had to, you know, move away several times or move to schools that were, you know, closer to the city so um, so she could access certain services, things like that, and um, funding. Um, so, yeah, she's actually, you know, missed out on living in a community environment and so have I, like it was actually by the end of 2015, like I was just feeling so isolated and like we were going down this road and it wasn't where I wanted to go, you know, when I look, look forward to what's going to be there for Freya when she finishes school, what's going to happen for me, like you know, when she was younger, I was able to uh, study a bit, work a bit. There was family daycare, that sort of stuff. So it was a little bit like having a normal kid. I could still pursue my own interests to an extent. Um, even though, you know, she never went to friends' houses. Like, uh, actually, the school she was in put her in different classes with different kids each year. So she never really got to build up a group of friends I didn't feel to go into high school with 